The hero's dead. I couldn't be that person even if I wanted to be. And I don't want to be. This is so cool! Oliver walked away. We're ghosts. They're like nothing we'd ever seen before. Well trained, well armed. We need the hero. You don't know who I am, do you? I'm Damien Dark. What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video of the Justice Corps, and today we're gonna to be talking about Arrow Season 4 premiere. Let's do this! Boom! So it starts off with Oliver running through this forest-like area. You know, he's running, he's running, he's running, he's got a green sweater on, and then boom, he runs out and he's in a suburban neighborhood, yeah. and he's living a normal life he's with just Felicity. Jogging, you know? he's just he was just jogging, exercise. and you come to find out that him and Felicity have moved to a different city and they're living a good life now they yeah. they left all of the arrow stuff behind and they're happy that way on the other hand uh star city team arrow or uh, should i say team diggle they're still fighting they're still taking care of the city and you know now this group is diggle laurel and uh thea but they're still taking care of the city. They're taking down these guys that are called the ghosts. So we get to see Damien Dark in person. And he he comes up out of the board meeting and, and we find out that he has this mystical abilities. This opens the Arrowverse to now Constantine, Dr. Faye, and Zatanna. So Oliver is reached by Laurel and Thea because they need help. So Oliver's like, uh, I can't do this. I don't want to do this. This this the arrow is gone But at the end of the day we find out that Felicity has been working with them all along and um, You know Felicity misses this misses the action misses all the computer stuff And so Oliver is like, you know what? I miss it too Like I miss I, I miss I miss, I miss my city. I miss my friends and he's like all right I'll help just for now. So now that Oliver has come back. We see him in this yes. brand new amazing suit that Cisco made and it's, thank you, thank you, Cisco. And they, love it. speaking about costumes, we get to see Diggle in his new costume. He looks really badass, like yeah, like when the we, Punisher kind of, but more Diggle. When we first saw like the the costume, like a lot of people were like, really, like this is what you're gonna oh, give him. But now that we saw him in action, it actually works for what he is, what yes. he does. As always, flashbacks are back, and we're seeing Oliver finally, you know, uh, free. But he runs into Waller, and she's like, "Yo, work for me." And he's like, nah, I'm good. And then and she's then, like, you don't got a choice. <laughs> and then he drinks something and he goes to sleep. He wakes up to he he wakes up in he wakes up in a plane and he's like, yo, you're gonna go down there or we're gonna shoot you. And he's like, uh, uh, okay. Where am I going? <laughs> and he's like, you're the only person that knows this place. So he's back on Leon you for like the seventeenth time. And it's it's so funny because like he was trying to escape that place for so long and I don't understand why he didn't just, like, he, he didn't just go home. <laughs> just go home, Oliver. <laughs> so now that Oliver is back temporarily helping the team, he he decides that you know what, this city needs me a lot more than I realized, and so he makes a public service announcement. I am the Green Arrow, and that he is here to help. Yes. And we yes. finally. He's a green arrow! Yes. Like, that's what we've been waiting for. Yes! And so now we, we're really- Yes! <laughs> <laughs> and so now we're just really waiting to see him, like, transform into the quirky green arrow that we know to love. Another thing that we noticed is that the stunts, or like the, the visual mm. effects, are way better. It's much it's better. Good. Much better. Such wow. Such wow. <laughs> At the end of this episode, we realized that Lance is working slash forced to work with Damien Dark. What the what? Damien Dark is also working with a group known as Hive. So now we see that uh, Hive has a bigger connection than we realize. So that's gonna be really interesting because you know Lance pretty much has to choose between his daughter's team or Hive. So it's it's gonna it's gonna put him in a really bad situation. So we skip for it six months later and we find out that someone really important has died. And, and this is, it's such a tearjerker because the last scene before this, it was Oliver and Felicity giving off that Felicity may have been the one to die. And so we see hit Oliver at the grave and then Flash comes in and- Sorry, I'm late for the funeral. Zoom. 
Yeah. You know, I promised myself that I wouldn't let this darkness destroy my friends and family. So now it is my responsibility. I have to end it. I'm gonna kill him. Is there anything I can do? I just want to be left alone right now. Understand. Well, at this point, we don't know who died, and it's so. It's, it's, it's a big I hate moment. it. I hate it. It could be Felicity. It could be Thea. It could be uh, Diggle, Diggle. It could be Laura. It could be Lance. But we don't know yet. It and I, I love that they didn't reveal at all who it was. He doesn't like it, but I mean, like it. It, it makes it so much more powerful. I'm glad they didn't show us. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of The Justice Corps. And did you like this episode of Green Arrow? Green Arrow, yes! <laughs> I'm so happy that I'm able to say that now. Green Arrow. The Green Arrow. Come back and see next week's episode of Season 4, Episode 2 of Arrow. So what's up, guys? So we, if you would like to check out our other videos, we have The Flash right here. And if you want to check out... Another episode of Gotham, it will be right here. Thanks, guys. It'll help out a lot. All right. See you next time. Over and out. Move out.